Hello everyone, my name is Goldheart. We are here playing a new game. It's called Anodyne. It's an indie game that's recently been released on Steam, and it's only been made by two people. So, uh, first off, Anodyne itself, the word, you know, I never came across it, I, so I decided to look it up. For those of you who are interested, as an adjective, it's used for someone, something or someone that's not likely to offend, or as a noun used as a painkiller. So, I, I don't know what, how this anodyne word is used in reference to the game, but let's start by beginning the narration. Mysterious voice says, hello, young, hey, oh, you can hear me, good, now listen, you are about to wake up, you will use the arrow keys to move around, oh, nice, thank you, alright, so, we've woken up, we're in some outer dimension, we're going to use a teleporter, okay, very strange, um, you will press the C key to interact with objects and people around you. Alright, cool. So, I guess we can't get through here, so we're gonna use this monitor here. Whoa! Didn't want that to happen. Or wait, was that part of the game? I have no idea. <laughs> I have no idea what just happened there. Adobe Air wanted me to update. And you will press the Enter key to access the menu which will provide you with information about yourself and your surroundings. Okay, so let's press the enter key. We have a map, we have items, cards, we can save the game, which we're gonna do right now, and there's a configuration to set controls and stuff like that, but we, need to, we don't need to go through that. Excuse me, let's go back, go to the teleporter. Oh, what is this place? Oh. Okay, interesting, interesting. Let's check it out. What is this thing here? There is writing scrolled in this rock. Sometimes, if you talk to people multiple times, they have new things to say. Okay, so... So this is, uh... Wait a minute, I don't think we saved. Saved! Okay, great, we saved. I, I thought I saved last time, but obviously that wasn't right. Whoa, cloaked man. Well, it's about time. Err. I mean... Greetings, young! I am Sage, the village elder. You have been summoned here because the darkness has spread across the land. The darkness seeks the legendary Briar. To use a Briar's power for evil. You must reach it first. You must protect the Briar. Okay. Alright, so we have an objective. I have no idea what's going on. This village el elder is telling us to find the Briar, protect the Briar. Statue, the village elder in name only, for he is neither. What? Okay, so he's like this copycat or fake elder. While standing on a checkpoint, press C to save your progress and set it as your respawn point if you die. Simple enough. Let's keep going. That's a gate that we can't get through. Okay. Let's talk to this guy again. Village Elder, no, no, that's not, I don't want to talk to the statue. Enter the active portal on your left to begin your quest. That was a portal? Oh, bro. <laughs> okay. Portal. Portal time. Alright, so we're on a road. Run down road. There's some barricades here. Checkpoint saved, and what's this up here? What's this thing? The door is locked. Alright, so that means we need to take a detour. Oh, no. Okay, I don't think I have a weapon. Nope, that isn't gonna work. We're gonna take the other detour. Let's see what's over there. That's a button. That opens the gate. Okay, great. Oh no, go to the gate from behind us. An engraving on the broom handle reads, press C to sweep. <laughs> okay, great. So we have a broom. We have a broom. We're gonna take care of these lambs. Come on, slime. Come on. You got nothing on me. Alright, let's go. Let's continue onwards. And you can tell on the top there, we have a map of sorts. So it'll tell, me, tell us which room we're in. Alright, now that we have a broom, we can take care of these slimes. Come 
are you? Oh, a card. Come here. Come here. Yeah, alright, so I think what we picked up there was a card, no? No, it wasn't. Pretty sure it looked like a card. Anyway, let's open this up. This key may be used a single time to open up a locked barrier. Alright, so this is what we're gonna use to lock, open up the barricade. Ah, there we go. Some more slimes. Come here, you. Come here. What is that stuff that they're dropping? I have six things on the top of my screen now. I guess they're health? I suppose that they're my health. Whoa! Oh, creepy dude. Creepy dude following me. I don't like that. Get away. Get away! Man, what was that? I have no idea, but this game... Oh, it's... it's becoming a little creepy. What's this stuff? Your room is now full of dust. Attack again to place it. Huh. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Save. I don't understand why we needed to pick up dust in our broom and then place it somewhere. Heads up! Oh, are you okay there? Sorry about that, I was going way too fast. Oh, I've never seen you before. Are you a fellow traveler? Huh. You want to protect the briar from the evil darkness? Dot dot dot. Well. I have no clue what you're talking about. Yeah, I'm pretty sure we're talking crazy. That sounds cool, I guess. Let's talk to him again. I've just been out and about peddling my wares. What? No, I'm not a salesman. Wares is the name of my bicycle. <laughs> peddling wares. It's a nice name for a bicycle. What else does she have to say? Well, maybe we'll run into each other again sometime. I'll let you know if I hear anything about that briar. I don't even know what a briar means. Oh, and she's off. Oh, we're alone now. Okay, let's continue for- Whoa. What's with that music? What is with that music? Okay, get out of here. Get out of here, you damn slime. More health. I think that's what it is, health. Pretty sure. Let's damage ourselves. Yep, it's health. And we can pick it back up again. Okay. Confirmed as health. And this is four on the gate here. wonder what that means. Let's see, what's over here? What's over here? Oh, it's a it's another tombstone thingy. Rock. I'll bet you're reading a rock because you don't have any friends. Wow, that hurts. That hurts, dude. <laughs> uh, I like this game already. Um, let's see what's down here. It's a chest. Oh no. Oh no, it's a bat. What do we what do we Oh god, it was so quick. I had no idea what to do there. Chest. It's a photo of someone. I believe that's a card that we use. Okay, select. I don't mind being watched by the trees. That's what the card says. I don't mind being watched by the trees. Oh, this, this is this is weird. This is weird. Okay, let's keep going. Backtrack our way through. Let's see what's down here. I wish that weird, intense music wouldn't be playing. Or eerie music, I suppose. Seven lock gate. Can't get through there. Climbing back up. And back up. Have to backtrack all the way around because I'm pretty sure we need to find a key. Somehow. What's, what's here? What's over here? Hmm. Nope. Nothing of particular interest. Let's keep going. The slime. Have at the. Oh, whoops. There we go. Should be something over here. Should be. Stick it that. Rotate around. Oh, it hit me. That wasn't good. Hey, it's a village elder. Sage. Soon your skills will be put to the test, young. In order to make it through this temple alive, you will need both strength and intellect. And I assume that by this point you have found a weapon. Yeah, we have a we have a broom. Are you gonna give us something else? What? Well, I I mean, yes, of course, a broom. 
Er, just as was foretold in the legend. <laughs> okay. Grumble, grumble. Of all the incompetent. Hey! What are you still standing here for? So we have a broom. You got a problem with that? That's the only weapon I could find. Come on. Saving. Alright, let's see what the statue has to say. I've been a broom in a legend. I, I mean, I've seen a broom in a legend. It was on the map of a janitor closet. <laughs> I was just gonna repeat what it said. Let's talk to the elder again. Just keep your wits about you, young. Okay, fine. It's the best advice you can give me. Uh, okay, so what do, we have, what do we have here? We have got some eye statues. We've got some pulsing laser things over here. We've got some eerie blue torches, torches to the side at the top there. So what do we need to do here? So let's remove that. Remove this. Room there. Oh, so the dust blocks the laser things. I wonder why though. I mean, what's the point of all? Ow! Ow, got too close to that. Let's save. Let's save. I have no idea what I'm doing here. I no idea what these pulsers are for, but we'll find out later. What's this? The statue's a little bit different from the rest. Give me a health. Give me a health card. Oh, what is that thing? What is that thing? Does it shoot things at us? Sneak about. Get that chest. You have a key. Great. I wonder if we can attack it. Let's try it. Oh! Oh, it didn't like that. Oh, I'm pretty sure it's invisible. It's invincible. <laughs> wasn't wasn't really falling to our broom attacks there. Okay, so we have a key. Let's keep going forward. Some more of those laser thingies. So we use this broom. Just to block off the... Okay, that's... Oh, hey! Oh, no, no, no! We can walk through it! Nice! Alright. Oh, more of those invincible shield things. They don't really look hostile, though, so I think we're good. Now, we have a key. I wonder if we can use it to... Open these. No? It looked locked? No? What if we... What if we... Knock these things into it? I'm just curious. I'm just curious. Nope. It doesn't do it. It doesn't do it. Alright. Heading back. Oh no. Dust just reset. Some more dust. Let's go over here. Oh, it's getting dark. It's a little dark. Rock. Peripheral vision is the hive of demons. What? Peripheral visions is a hive. So if something were to be in my peripheral vision, it would be a demon hive. I don't understand the logic. But these boulders, we need to find a way to move these boulders. There's gotta be something. Something. I'm super confused right now. I, mean, I think we've gone to all places where we could go. Unless I missed another route that we could have taken. Seems like we we got the key on the left side. So now we need to Okay, maybe this is a, it's a clue. Maybe it's a clue. Purple vision is the hive of demons. So what is in my purple vision right now? Doesn't oh I mean like I can see the entire area. It's not like I have purple vision of anything. Hmm. Hmm. I'm a little stuck. Just a little bit. Pretty sure people who have played this before us are going, shaking their fists like, Oh, why aren't you doing this? Why aren't you doing that? But I have no idea, guys. I have no idea. But wait a minute. Can we use these things to break the boulders? Oh, hey, they, they do break. Huh. But they totally weren't. Oh, what the heck. I totally thought they were invulnerable. Okay, so that solved things. As, at first you don't succeed, just bash things. Just kill things. <laughs> Alright, so let's open up the key here. Got some more bats. Get away. Get away from me! Alright, so we need some dust. Or we need to find... Uh, let's just wait. And go. Standing here for no reason! No 
Okay, those are... <laughs> can't fall on those. Remember not to fall on those, but we can seem like we can get through here. Let's go back again. Oh gosh. Oh, the bat pushing back into the other... Into the other area. Don't do that to me. The trick is, is not to move when the bat, bat catches sight of you, or else you're just gonna take damage. Come at me. Here we go. There we go. Alright, let's try and kill these things and see if it doesn't unlock the gate. No? Oh, wait a minute. Wait a minute. I think... I think... No. Never mind. No, it's just... I almost thought I was onto something, but I wasn't. Uh, let's... How come these things are invincible now? What was I doing before that was different? They took... Ah... Oh, do, do you need to throw them against a boulder or something? So that they can take damage? No? Oh, super confused. We have that hint with something about peripheral vision being a monstrous eye. Whoa! Almost got zapped there. Alright, let's use this dust, block that off, and we can proceed through. more of those shield guys. Oh, nice. Alright, we need to... We need to... Suck these guys into there. Ah, lovely. Some more of these shield guys. I wonder what this button does. Hmm. Well, we'll find out by... Ow. Okay, how am I gonna get you? How am I supposed to get you up there? I want you to press that button. Mm -hmm. Okay, hang on a second. Let's reset this again. Let's get out of here. And reset it. I can't really get below you, so how am I gonna get you touching that button? Can we move the boulder somehow? Can we push it? Uh, no, it doesn't work. Okay, so. Somehow, we're gonna have to get you up. There we go. Oh, so it was like a... There you go. Okay. And then you push up, and then we get to go. And you unlock the key again. Alright, so we're gonna use the dust here. Is there like a gap in his shooting? Use the dust to fill in the hole? That doesn't make much sense. Nope, I don't think so. Whoa! Okay, how's this going? <laughs> I don't think that's gonna work there. Uh, we need. Hmm. Hmm, this door is locked, yes. I know that, I know that. Oh, I see. Maybe we can. Yeah, here, here we go. Ow, here we go. We can use the dust to progress slowly up this lane until we're in the clear, like so. Yay! Now, what's this? Use that to unlock it. All right, so we came from the other side. Now we need to destroy this guy. Get over here. Get over here. There you go. Oh no, that destroyed the dust. Oh, we're still. No, we're good. Oh, never mind. Okay. Oh no, it's dark again. Oh no, it's dark again. Oh, isn't it cute? Precious little young, playing the hero. But I have witnessed every step you have taken in the land, and let me tell you, young, not everyone here is as, is as honest as me. Be careful who you trust. All right, Mr. Creepy Mask Dude. Wait. Oh man, it's a boss fight. I'm not ready for this. I'm not ready for this. Ow. Okay, so we hit him once. Now we have one health left. Oh god. <laughs> I totally wasn't ready for that. We're gonna continue. 
and we're at the last checkpoint. So we just need to... We need to proceed through and take on that boss again. Alright. Alright, here we go. I'm gonna skip all this. We've read it all before. And I'm gonna be a little bit more careful. Alright. So he's swinging those two orb-like things. Very dangerous. Oh, man. I need to get myself close so I can room him. There we go. Oh, no, 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 I got him here. He's going on a rampage. He's going on a rampage. He's leaving a bunch of dust behind. I wonder if we can use that to our advantage. Is that... Oh, no, oh, no, no, no. He's doing something really dangerous. I don't know what that was. But those two orbs are too close to him. Can't really do anything about that. Whenever you are alone. And remember my advice on your little adventure. Okay. So I don't think we fully kill him. Some dramatic lightning. Oh, it's a fairy. Hello, little fairy. How you doing? Oh, and he healed all our health. Nice. Okay. Uh, what's he doing now? Is he pooping? I don't understand what that was. But okay, continuing on. Hey, it's the... Where, why are you here? At this point, you are still weak. If you hope to protect the briar from the darkness, you must face your fears. The card you will find in this chest, and others like it, are symbols of your growth. So acquiring them is absolutely vital to your quest. Okay, great. I don't care what you have to say. I want to know what the statue has to say. Statue. Acquiring cards is vital to your quest. Acquiring cards is also vital for other quests, such as earning credit or purchasing alcoholic beverages. <laughs> okay. Let's save it. Let's open up the chest. Oh, and we get the creepy mask chest card thing. Great. Pick up the key. Yay. It's spinning wildly over our head. That means we've earned it. More lightning bolts. Great. Cool. Alright, so that's it for my first episode. And I am just, you know, this this game is really fun, actually. I'm going to continue with it. And I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. Please like this video if you did like my, my video. And, uh, yeah. I'll see you guys next time.